A sudden arrival of migrants prompts a closure of an international bridge. The closure earlier today can be seen at bridge number one in Laredo, where both pedestrian and vehicle traffic was stopped. In a statement, Customs says it was responding to a significant group that was trying to get across without inspection. Channel 5's Christian Von Pricing explains what we know about CDP's protocol for these kinds of closures. Over the past several months, we've been seeing temporary bridge closures at the ports of entry here in the valley, but those are for drills. Today in Laredo, they put those drills into practice. The bridge in Laredo reopened just after 2 p.m. today. Traffic was stopped in both directions while that happened. No traffic going north, no traffic going south. We don't know how many people attempted to cross the bridge in Laredo. Customs did not specify. Video we obtained from Nadia Avila, a reporter from Mexico, shows the group a group of dozens walking off the International Bridge back into Mexico. We do know that customs officers along bridges all along South Texas have been doing these readiness exercises. They're practicing what they call mobile field force training, including the use of riot shields, concertina wire, and mobile barriers to block access points, getting ready to block access on bridges if it's needed. In fact, here at the Progreso International Bridge a couple months ago, they installed a fence on hinges that could be opened and closed to keep people out if needed. Right now here in the valley, we are not seeing anything out of the ordinary. Live at the Progreso International Bridge, Christian Von Pricing, Channel 5 News at 6.